So you're still shocked, huh? I can't believe you're here. What about your road trip to Yale? Well, Fiona said that you were worried about that, so I made other arrangements. You know, I almost flew to New York. But why do you think I told you not to? And, you know, I'm sorry I had to be so harsh, but I didn't want to ruin the surprise. You haven't checked your voicemail? Yeah, so I forgot to turn it back on after the flight. Uh, What's wrong? You told me not to come. I kind of jumped to conclusions. Oh, no. Just ignore it. Now I'm kind of curious. Mm, skip it. Delete it. It's driving me insane. And um, it makes me realize that I sort of Are you kidding? This is, this is classic. If you're hooking up with some high-class skank? Wow. Thus being so far apart for so long, my imagination just ran wild. Well, I'm here now. So it doesn't matter. Really missed you. Feel to be back. I miss this city. <laughs> and I even kind of miss Degrassi. Mm. And I definitely miss the smartest girl on earth helping me with my assignments. What? There's no smart people at Vanderbilt. It's very competitive. Uh, only 200 more days to graduation, though. Hey, I'm sorry it's all on you to come here. My mom would have killed me if I bought a flight to New York. <laughs> How bad is it? I mean, your situation. It's a lot worse than I expected. <sighs> what about day to day? What? Well, fun money. The girl's gotta live, right? Yeah, I'm uh, getting a job after school. And keep a 4-0 GPA, ace your SATs, rack up extracurriculars, take over student council. What choice do I have? Well, maybe I could help you out. Help me out? How much do you need? I mean, if I can help you focus on school. Whoa. So you want to pay me not to work? Just, just, just think about it. See you tonight. Guys, three tenants are gonna blow the roof off this place. Yeah, we might need to change the name. And I was thinking, maybe the whole thing's not a good idea. I mean, are you kidding? Once people see us on stage, they'll never call us that again. And to get our sound out sooner. I booked a recording session with Sav. Awesome. I have you guys huge. What are we gonna do? Okay. All right, today we'll get into a new component in our study of human-machine symbiosis, artificial limbs. The ability of technology to compensate for physical deficiencies is truly awe-inspiring. That's it. Thank you, Wesley. It is fascinating. It's pizza day in the cat. A dollar a slice. All hey, hey. Thank you for the heads up. Tell me you're not mad at me. Did it ever occur to you that hearing Declan tell me that he didn't want to see me might make me think that he didn't want to see me? 
He made me promise not to tell. I'm a pawn, Holly J. It's OK, because he's here. And I'm 200% happy. So you love birds have your date tonight? Yeah, and Declan's actually made sure that I won't have to spend my evenings waiting tables. Really? How? He's going to help me out, financially. Oh. Oh? Well, that can get weird. And just the other day, you accused me of trying to pay you to be my friend. This is different. Declan and I are long term. What's his is mine, and once I'm rich and successful on my own, what's mine is his. Well, good for you. <laughs> oh, how would you like access to the finer things youth prohibits? You have the idea or what? You'll be pleased. My guy's an expert craftsman. Looks good. Does work good? No more hassles? As long as this works. I have my word. So, what's the plan? When the police check Fitz's fake ID and mistake him for an escaped arsonist, hilarity ensues. What do we do until then? Ah, grasshopper. There are ways to expedite the process. It's Dizzle, Breaching Wizzle and Kizzle. Uh. You were always alive, always on my mind. I never even see you. That's why love is blind. And sister? Looks like you made peace with your tormentor. So he thinks. Right. Mission accomplished. Claire, my mission is just getting started. That Neanderthal started something. And I'm going to end it. What are you going to do? Show him that my reputation is more than just a rumor. If Eli's going to do something bad, someone needs to stop him. Maybe you should stay out of it. He has a surprise for Fitz, and it's gonna be big. I know what you look like, but I'd recognize you on sight. When I talk to you, I think, oh, I should call you up, and then, whoa, we're gonna meet you, say when. I'll never frag you again. All right, let's hear it. Buckle up. It's Dizzle. Reaching whistle and kizzle. Well, hold up. What, what did you do? I auto tuned it. Why? You're singing. You just need a little help. <laughs> What's wrong with my singing? It's terrible. No, it's awesome. No, it's it's terrible. Like really terrible. So stop. Fixed it. We can put this effect on when we play live. Yeah, it's choice, like T-Pain styles. Now, you guys are losers. And so am I for hanging out with you. I thought we agreed no shopping. Where did this come from? It was delivered. Something for you to wear tonight. It's from Declan. Oh, wow, bibbity bobbity boo. What is this his attempt to try and bribe his way back? Oh, no, we didn't break up. <laughs> Holly J, he cheated on you. No, he didn't. He came here to see me. It was all in my head. I was just being paranoid. Have you thought about what I said? You know, what I don't understand is why you think I'm either doing stuff for myself or to be with Declan. It can be both. And what about doing something for your family? Did you call the restaurant? I have better things to do than deal with whiny requests for free refills. Well, good to know your superiority complex is alive and well. And what's wrong with that? 
I have to work 200 times harder to get what I want thanks to your and Dad's mistakes. We have given you every opportunity. And I'm trying to take advantage of them. If Declan wants to buy me a necklace, so what? You're naive if you think this is just about a necklace. Nothing comes for free, Holly J. Now who's being paranoid? Enjoy playing grown-up tonight. Then finish packing. We move to the depressing apartment on Sunday. That's a rock. <laughs> Did you rob a bank? It's a gift from my boyfriend. Nothing says love like a little blue box. Must be nice to have a sugar daddy. Excuse me? <clears throat> Gold digger. I'm not a gold digger. Oh, I'm, I'm just teasing. You wish you had someone to buy you nice things. It's OK, she wouldn't understand. Do you want to eat for lunch? Oh, I can't. I'm meeting my decorator. You two should hear yourselves. Nine one one. there's a fight outside McGrath Variety. It looks serious. No, I'll stay on the line. Oh, oh, no, they see me. Come quick. Hey, moron. The ID worked, eh? Those things will kill you. What the hell do you want? <laughs> That's good. I get that. It's totally awesome. <laughs> Ladies, room for one more? What are you doing here? What else am I going to do? I'm only in town to see you. May I? What's mine? It's yours. Oh. Holly J gets diamonds, you get tuna salad. You're getting ripped off, dude. Well, if Holly J comes with me to Yale this weekend, I'll consider us even. What? Yeah, you can't miss it. You were prepared to get on a flight yesterday. When I thought you were cheating on me. Hey, look, I already booked the flights and the hotel room, so. Declan, I have my SATs. Reschedule them. I also have to help my parents move. That's boring. <sighs> OK, fine, you know, I'm already paying for you not to work. I might as well pay for the movers, too. It's not that easy. I thought the plan was that we'd visit each other. Just come for a few days, please. I just can't. Come on. How much will I have to spend before you do what I ask? Just drop it, prepping. Go home. Just go. I'll call you later. Well, whatever. <sighs> Bye. Is that enough? Punch like my grandma. Oh, really? Hey, this is over. Now, turn around. You just stay right here while I run these. Sucks to be you. Why is that? A fake ID. They won't even know who I am. Guess it's your lucky day. The guys. Oh, uh, they went to Connor's house to play Xbox. But you didn't? <laughs> I'd rather be here alone than with those lame wads. What are you doing? Sometimes you know I can support. When I talk to you, I think, oh, I should call you up and then whoa. I don't even know what you look like, but I recognize you. Dude, it sounds really cool. So what? It's not me. It's you, only better. Listen, I was in a band. It was the best time of my life, hanging out with my best buds, goofing off, making tunes. 
but they all moved on, and I'm left here. That sucks, bro. But what's your point? Well, those guys came up with the band idea because you were in the dumps, and they wanted to cheer you up. You're not messing with me? You can't ask for better friends than that. Auditions are still open. This one's okay. Hands behind your back. What did I do? Well, we're gonna sort that out at the station. What about me, officer? You can go. We got bigger fish to fry today, huh? I didn't do anything. Yeah, then you got nothing to worry about. You have the right to remain silent. What did he tell you? I can make that an order. Get in the car. Once you've all aced your SATs tomorrow, we will send the results to the universities of your choice. So let's go through an application. Now you know about the essays and the supporting documents, and then there's this section on financial aid, aka your introduction to years of student debt. So be honest with your responses, because nothing on this application will be used to discriminate against you. Makes you wonder why people like us even go to college. People like us? So, uh, well, I have my trust fund. You have Declan. We're taken care of. Where were you this afternoon? Conflict resolution. So it's resolved? So much for nonviolence. Minor scares, but nobody got hurt. What happened? Cops had a break of a fight. And somebody put the name of a convicted arsonist on Fitz's fake ID. Oops. <laughs> He'll be spending a few hours at the cop shop. You had him arrested? He'll be out as soon as they clear up the mistaken identity. Let's just say I'd rather be feared by Fitz than liked. So that's it? Yeah, what'd you expect? I don't know. I was just on my way to Simpson's office to express concern over your mental stability. Claire, give me some credit. Worse that happens, he gets busted for a fake ID possession. Might have to go to court. And what if he tells the cops where he got it? His words against mine? He's gonna be pretty mad. Speak of the devil. Good one, Eli. You got me. You do realize that that ID was just for novelty purposes only. I'll have to tell that to the judge. Hope you learned your lesson. Too bad for you, I'm a slow learner. So what now? Aren't you at war? I'm in his head. Right where I want to be. I'm really glad you changed your mind. And when we're back in New York, I'll borrow my dad's car and we'll catch up with the guys at Yale, with their own hotel room, of course. Man, I miss being with you so much. I'm not going anywhere. Excuse me? I can't take your money. <laughs> what? what? What's going on? It makes me feel gross. Holly J, money exists to solve problems. So that's what I am to you? I'm, the, I'm a problem. No, why are you doing this? Turn left at the lights. Okay, no, we're, we're going to the airport. We're not. What's wrong with you? I thought we were part of each other's dreams, but... You only want to make me a part of yours. Holly J. I don't need your help. I need time to figure this out away from you. Yeah, but you've been away from me. And in a relationship online and over the phone, that's the problem. Well, then maybe we should go on a break. I want to know what you know. Great. I want to go away. On a break. Take a trip to the end of time Kiss your lips, grab your hips and fly away Turn left Dave hates us 
Who's gonna lead us out of the Great Tangetto now? We'll find someone, Wes. We'll find someone. It's Dizzle. Breaching Wizzle and Kizzle. Uh. Hey, that's us. You guys like it? We sound like robots. <laughs> guys, the band plan. It's our destiny. Are we gonna rise to the occasion? Are we gonna run like cowards? Um, is that you guys? You know it, three tenors. It's funny. It sounds kind of cool. Funny and cool. We could do worse, right? Band slam. So you guys there? Yeah, we'll be there. Nice work, boys. Nice work. Thank you so much for the second chance. With your resume, we're glad you could make it out on such short notice. And you're sure I can have tomorrow off for my SATs? <laughs> Just remember us when you win your first Nobel Prize. Remember, eye contact, energy, smiles. Check, check, check. Good. We've already had a special request for our new waitress. <laughs> what are you doing here? Mr. First Shift? I think not. Mm. I'm proud of you, sweetie. Did Declan tell you about our fight? He called me from the airport in tears. And you're not mad. I'm your friend, Holly J. So, what are your specials? Well, you have to try the Parmesan artichoke dip and the shrimp cocktails to die for. How am I doing? I'm buying it. <laughs> Whatever it takes I know I can make it through And if I hold out my love, I know I can make it through I know I, I know I can make it through